everybody, it's Susie here, and I have somebody really awesome on the channel today, Jody from OneDetailedMama.com, and she has just recently started blogging, like a couple months ago. I think Jody just told me it was back in April, and since then, she has grown her blog to a good success, like for a first-time blogger. She is doing amazingly, so I'm, before stealing all her thunder, here's Jody. Can you tell us more about you and what you've done the last couple months? Yes. Um, so I started my blog back in April, of late April, and but I had been thinking about it for quite some time, and I finally got the courage in April, and I've learned so much in the last few months, and I, I know it's a patient game, and it, it, you know you have to be patient, and I'm trying, but the small successes I've had have been so helpful in just keeping me motiv motivated to keep going. Um, so tell us about this. It's not that small. It's pretty huge, the success that you've reached so far. And it's only been what April, so late April, April, May, June, July, August. So five months, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So tell us yeah. about the success. Okay. So my biggest success is thanks to you and your printables course. Um, and that has been huge in terms of my confidence because everything else, you know, you always have doubts. You doubt yourself. You doubt if your content is good enough, if you're doing the right things, if your pins are attractive. Um, but seeing the success with printables has helped me not only feel confident in myself, but also helped to build some money so that I can invest more in my blog and my resources. So I've reached a thousand on my printables. Wow. Yes. And I, you know, I just was looking back. I only started, um, I started taking your course on the 12th of May. I saw that. And, yeah. yeah. And it's crazy. Um, and then, so it didn't take me long. Your course was so easy. Um, I, I went through it and then I was just motivated and I just started creating. And um, so, yeah, so it's just, just taken off since then. And, you know, it, it's funny because my most successful product is actually the first thing I ever made, um, which I, I then am seeing that, you know, you don't always have to reinvent the wheel a hundred different times, you, you know, so I'm learning a ton. Um, but yeah, the printables has been a huge success um, in my blog for my blog. And yeah. it's something you created yourself. Like, yeah, that is the, the first time I sold a small digital product. Like I was ecstatic. I was so happy. Mm -hmm. I sat on the edge of the bed. It was right before church. And I just couldn't believe somebody actually bought one of my products and I didn't have to go ship them anything. Like, it's already done. Exactly. Yeah. It's so easy and it's, it will become passive. You know, now I've got a library. I have 43 listings and they're just, you know, I tweak them all the time just to kind of improve them, but they're there. Yeah. And I, I too, the first time, so I cried the first time someone bought something, but then I waited for like the return button. <laughs> I'm like, they're, they're, they're going to return it. I know it. I know it's not, it's not great. Um, but it was great. And I've got, that's actually been the proudest I've been is getting the comments from people that have bought the product and how much has helped them. That, because that was my goal. I'm a really organized person and it was basically an extension of how I live my life, you know, and I've helped my friends and family for years, yeah. you know, to try to get more organized, but this is something that I can provide that will help you get more organized. Right. And it's helping so, other people. Cause if you take that, yeah. if you help them with the organization, like their life kind of falls in place again, because if there's a big mess around you, it's just like, mm -hmm. you can't think, especially me as a mom with little kids, like if there's a mess, I just kind of flounder about, I don't know yeah. what to do. So having people like you in our life to help us organize our house and our messes then enables us to be more successful in other parts of our lives. Yeah. And, you know, I, I became more organized after I wanted to spend more time with my kids when they were small. Yeah. And yeah. I just kept tr trying to work smarter, not harder, because I found myself, because I had three that were five and under, and I was just constantly organizing and cleaning. And then I was like, 
I am going to miss these years. And of course, now that they're older, I do miss the years still, but I did spend more time with them because I was more organized and life just was a lot easier. Yeah. 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 So how did you have the confidence to start your blog in April and then pretty much launch your own online product a couple weeks later? Um, (laughs) I just did it. Good. Good. And I just did it. Yeah. And I didn't, you know, it's taken me a long time to get the confidence, but I figured there really was not a whole lot to lose right. besides pride. Yeah. <laughs> if nobody purchased it, <laughs> I'd be, I'd cry a little, you know, but then that would motivate me to make a different product. Yeah. yeah. You know, so it was like, I can put this out there and just see. And yeah the response has been great. And I've, and like I said, it's given me so much confidence really in all aspects of my life. Um, just not that I walk around, <laughs> you know, I sell exactly. printables. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Um, but I just feel like I'm doing something, the life that I have, I, I have to work at home. I have to be around for my, my daughter. Um, but it makes me feel good that I'm making money. Yeah. You know, I'm doing it myself. Yeah. Oh man. I love your story. It's just so, so beautiful. And it's like you, cause you kind of got stuck on the question. It's not like I asked you, did you have the confidence? You're like, I didn't have the confidence, but yeah. I did it. And it helps you enable to see like, does the audience like it? If they don't like it, then you do something better and different. Um, so yeah. how do you promote your beautiful printables? How do you actually get people to come to your website and buy them? That is something I'm definitely still working on, Mm -hmm. um, a Pinterest. Um, and I, I've been able to, so the printables all started when I wanted to, I created a lead magnet to start an email list. Yep. And if you look back at my first lead magnet, like I cry out of disappointment. So (laughs) I, I knew what was in my head and I wanted to provide something that was more useful. So I basically went back and I revisited it and made it a lot better. And that is one way I get people to my website is Pinterest lead magnet. Mm -hmm. I do promote on Etsy. I spend several dollars a day just to kind of get it out there. Yeah. Yeah. Um, And that's really it. I've written articles, so hopefully one day when SEO kicks in. It'll take a little bit because your blog's so new. Yeah. Yeah. Although the other day I was not a, how can I humble brag? I got the featured snippet for, yeah, it's not there any longer. It went down to spot number four. (laughs) Google. But it was so funny. I, I showed my daughter and she's like, is Google okay? Like, are, are they, like, what's wrong with Google? Yeah. <laughs> like, hey. But, um, so that's one way I hope long-term to be able to promote my products. Like I've written about the benefits of a home management binder, which is I sell home management printables. Awesome. Um, so that's one of the long-term strategies I have. Yeah. Um, yeah. But like I said, I'm still learning and I'm still even trying to figure out how much, you know, to promote with the ads on, I'm having a really hard time selling things from my website. I don't Mm. have a whole, so that is one area that I'm definitely trying to improve. Yeah. I have thrive cart. Um, I have send out, I've kind of got all the pieces, Yeah, yeah, but, um, I'm still working through that. All right. There's like, I looked at your website a little bit and there's definitely some tips I can give you after the call. So yeah. Yeah. No, for sure. I have, um, do you know Mayana from blogging? Like you mean that the group, she's like a technical person. Yeah. 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 I've seen her name. Yeah. Yeah. She always, um, is very helpful in comments and yeah. she is, I, I'm on her wait list awesome. to have her kind of, cause my category, like I've switched my categories. My categories yeah. don't match. Um, so it's all a process. There's some and organization on your blog that you want to work on. <laughs> How embarrassing, but yes, my blog organization is a disaster. No. 
That's okay. Um, <laughs> That's okay. We all need help in other different yeah. aspects. Yeah. That's yeah. awesome. So, I mean, like if you already know that your printer rolls are doing well and they're yeah. selling, then we just need to put the systems in place on your blog so that when people get there, they convert better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you already know your product is good. You've already sold a thousand dollars worth of it. Yeah. And I'm still, um, I'm creating new products. Yeah. I, I like, so one of my big things is to declutter first and then to clean and then mm -hmm. to organize. Yeah. And in cutting expenses, I'm the cleaning lady now and I've gotten a ton of tips. Um, so right now I'm writing an ebook room by room. Awesome. you know, just to, you know, and hopefully that when I have the system set up on my website, that will be able to be sold on my website. <laughs> yes. That could be an upsell after they get a printable. Like, yes. Hey, would you like the book that goes along with it? Or yeah. maybe a downsell? Would you like this printable pack as well? So there's yeah. a lot of things. If you have multiple products, you can create multiple small funnels that yeah. will help you sell them. So it's no, good to be sure. prolific. I think that's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. And do you like the whole printable creation process? I enjoy it so much. Yeah. I think if I, I it would be difficult if I didn't, yeah. but the, from researching the, the fonts, um, when you mentioned the color hex, yeah, I could be on that website for hours. Like I, <laughs> I love picking the colors for the printables and matching them and I love getting the things that are in my brain on paper. Yeah. Um, so creatively, it's been amazing. I, I really enjoyed. I could, if I let myself, I would design printables all day long. But <laughs> I, but I break my day into, I break my week into days. Yeah. So like printables are on a certain day, and Smart. I have to kind of stick to that. <laughs> Otherwise, I would spend all five days working on creative yeah. printables. Yeah, I, I get those too, definitely. Yeah. Um, so how does your daughter now see you as her mom who started her own blog and is selling her own things on her website? Really proud. Yeah. Really proud. Yeah. I'm going to start crying. Um, she, she subscribed to my newsletter the other day, which I thought was oh, adorable. That's really sweet. <laughs> Yeah. Um, and you know, we've been through a lot and, and it's just kind of, she's seen me in a new light Really, oh. and I, you know, and it's like, you can do whatever you want to do. Right. So, um, and like I said, I really, I need to be present for her 24 seven and this allows me to be present and take care of what she needs, her needs yeah. and still do my, my own thing. Right. And so she's really proud. That's awesome. That's awesome. Yeah. I mean, it's one of the big yeah. reasons why I do this too, is to be closer to my kiddos yeah. and then to show them that, Hey, you can be a mama and you can still do this stuff online too. Mm -hmm. You can build your own little brand and your own store and help other people. So, yeah. I mean, it's, it's so, such a beautiful circle of helping your own family, being an example to your children and then helping other moms and your audience as well. Yeah. So I absolutely love this stuff. Um, golly. So what advice would you give to somebody else who's watching this interview and they're thinking, oh, gosh, I can't do that. No, nah, that's just, that's, I'm never going to be a Judy. Uh, oh gosh, do it. Because I am not even close to where I want to be. And I think we're our own worst critic. Yeah. Um, you know, I still can't believe I'm being interviewed right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, really? Um, I, just no matter what, you'll learn a, a, so much about yourself in the process. Yeah. No matter what direction, even if you decide blogging isn't for you. Yeah. Um, you'll learn what you're good at, what you're not good at. Um, how you can time manage, you know, do better time management. You'll just learn so much more about yourself in the process. And I never thought that the blog would take me it, printables direction. Yeah. It just kind of happened through the lead magnet and wanting to create a better experience for my website user, but it, it's taken off and it's something I'm so passionate about that, I would have never dreamed I would be here if I didn't just leap and start 
Right. So just do it. You have nothing to lose. That's yeah. my best advice. I definitely There's nothing agree. to lose and everything to gain. I definitely agree. Definitely agree. Like we're never going to have all the confidence. I still don't have the confidence when I launch new products. I'm like, I hope they like it. I hope they like it. <laughs> I worked, I, really, I worked really hard on this one, but man, I hope they like it. And then I get to like the selling part. I'm like, it's really good. And I'm like, well, I spent weeks and months on this product. And I'm like, well, now I'm all, all of a sudden I'm flustered and I don't want to sell it. But like, yeah, you never have that perfect confidence, <laughs> but we just got to go, man. There's people yeah. that we got to help. There's other people that need us and we can do this. So Jody, yeah. where can people find you? Um, if their home is a mess and they're stressed out, where can we get you to help us organize our houses? Um, best place is my website, um, one detailed um, and that's the best place to reach me. Um, and I have a shop on Etsy with the same name, one detailed mama. Awesome. Um, and I do have products on my website, but that's a whole different ball of wax. <laughs> it's very different. So I'm working through that, but it's never going to be perfect. So you just start and you learn along the way. Definitely. Definitely. Jody, this has been awesome. I thank you so much. Um, you. As you grow, maybe we'll do a follow-up interview once you hit your first $10,000 selling printables, which yes, will happen. Yeah. If, it will. You keep, if you keep going like this, it's definitely going to happen. It so will that's going to be awesome. So thank, thank you, Jody. You. And I will see you in the next, next video then. Okay. Thank you so much, Susie. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs>